There's this fountain near my place of work. I like to spend a lot of my lunch breaks there. It's a serene place to relax and enjoy a stress-free session away from the hectic office life. If I could somehow do all my work while sitting next to the fountain, I would. Unfortunately, I'm still required to return to the office every day. Today, something happened on lunch that I couldn't explain. There was a strange noise coming from the fountain, like a low hum. Not a mechanical hum, but something human. I approached the fountain and looked down into the water. Ripples broke out across the surface from the churning water of the fountain, but I could still see clear to the bottom. It appeared empty. Still, the humming continued. I thought I was going crazy. Something in the water was making noise and I couldn't see it. The pitch began to rise and fall in a sort of melody. Now I knew it wasn't mechanical. Something or someone was down there. An impulse came over me and I dipped my face into the water. Liquid filled my ears, but so did the humming. It was clearer now. The distinct rise and fall of a melodic voice were clear. After several seconds, an image began to appear before my eyes. The bottom of the fountain was no longer visible. In fact, neither was the fountain. Instead, I found myself in a large body of water like the ocean. It was impossible. I could still feel my feet on solid ground, and yet, shifting my gaze in that direction, there was nothing but open water. This was only the second strangest thing I saw beneath the surface, however. Beings swam here and there, calling out their beautiful song. They were women, of sorts. My first thought turned to mermaids, but that wasn't quite right either. They looked beautiful with the upper body of a woman. Their lower half, however, was long and serpent-like. Not the scaly fish tails I would imagine a mermaid possessing. One of them approached me and stared directly into my eyes. She sat there for a moment, and I became lost in her bright blue eyes. Though she didn't speak a word, I knew exactly what she wanted, and I would give it to her. I lifted my head out of the water and looked around. The fountain was as it always had been, and I could see nothing below the surface. Resisting the urge to peer back beneath the water, I went back to work and about my day. While I sifted through work emails and expense reports, my mind could focus on nothing but the fountain. I needed to see it again. I needed to see them again. But I knew there was only one way of doing so. Heading off to the break room, I started chatting with one of my coworkers. I told him how I saw this cool thing swimming around in the fountain. An otter, I claimed. But I knew that was a lie. It didn't matter. I needed someone else to go to the fountain with me. And if I'd said I'd seen mermaids, I'd probably be committed. He grabbed his phone so we could snap a couple of pictures of the cute animals, and we went on our way. When we arrived, the fountain looked just like it always had. Nothing out of the ordinary. But I knew better. They were still down there. I could still hear the hum. It still sounded like a beautiful song, and I would join that song soon. When my co-worker said he couldn't find any otters, I told him he would need to look closer to the water. He pushed his face within inches of the surface, but I needed it closer. Grabbing the back of his head, I held his face underwater. His muffled screams told me he saw the beings. The humming in my ears grew louder and louder until finally my co-worker stopped moving. A hand came out of the water and pulled the body beneath the surface. I wanted to look, but I knew what my purpose was now. The beings required more sacrifices. Humans are their food, but they couldn't leave the water, so people like me are chosen to bring it to them. Of course, they don't live in the fountain. I'm not sure where they truly are, but they can open a portal of sorts through the water. All they need from me is deliveries every week. And I've got an office full of people who will do just fine.